There have been some XREF enhancements in how you manage the files and layers in this version of AutoCAD. XREF line types are no longer displayed in the line type list or in the properties palette. For example, if I need to draw a line and I want to change the layer, I select it and if I press Control 1, it will open up my properties palette. Now if I click on this list of layers, it only has layer 0 listed as an option, because that's all that I can apply to it. I can't apply layers from a referenced file. If I open up the XREF Manager by typing in XR, I can see that I have this ice rink file referenced in. That means if I open up the Layer Manager, type in LA, I will get a list of layers, but these are all from the ice rink, They're from that file and not this one. So that's good because when I'm in the Properties Manager, I can't list those out because I can't pick them as an option to apply to my object anyway. So that's nice. It's a little thing it cleans stuff up. Now the XREF attachment type is easily toggled now between attachment and overlay. If I close these other palettes and open up the XREF Manager, let's stretch it out here so we can get a good look at it. Now we can see this is the file I have referenced in, the ice rink example file. Now I can come down here to the bottom of my window and I can very quickly just click on this and I can change it from an attachment to an overlay. Click on it again, click attachment. So I can easily toggle that back and forth and that's nice. That's not something we could easily do before. I can also very quickly and easily switch a file that's referenced from an absolute path to a relative path. You scroll down here, you can see where the file is found at, where the actual saved path is for the file. And if I select the XREF here, I come up to the top of this external reference manager, I can change the path. If I click on this arrow, I can make it absolute or I can remove the path altogether. So if I make it absolute, and now it's an absolute path. You can also right click on it and get to some of your options here, attachment and overlay and the path right here. So those are some of the new things and new controls that you have over your XREFs with the XREF Manager. They're small, but they are things that you might find useful.